20 years, the IWK Health Center has been my go-to place when it comes to medical attention. Whether it was a small wheelchair fitting or an eye appointment, or even a big surgery, this place always had my back. Speaking of surgeries, you can see I wasn't feeling too good after this one, but that was a rough surgery. But not all surgeries are rough. This arm surgery was a cinch, and when it came to picking the color of my cast, they knew that green was my favorite. And speaking of cool colors, if you get a cast, make sure you ask for a custom design, because they do a really cool job. And sure, I had to have the surgery again, but this time on a different hand as you can see in the picture. This is the coolest design out of all of them. Love the camo. But despite having the cool patterns on your arm for a certain time, the final transformation always looks the best. Besides surgeries, you have friends in the hospital. Like Buddington the Clown, he definitely knows how to cheer you up. And I didn't even know he had a YouTube channel until he told me after our first video. So I helped him reach his 100,000 view goal. And he helped me by showing off the new Hot Wheels wheelie chair that me and my Hot Wheels group donated to the hospital. So, with all of the adventures that I had over the past 20 years, let's take one last look at 7Link. Hey guys, Jordan Little Elevators Canada here with the final tour of the 7Link recovery area here at the IWK Health Center. Um, I just had my last checkup appointment with my orthopedic doctor here and as my mom's heart specialist would say, I graduated, so uh, I'm gonna be transferred to the adult hosp hospital and go from there. So I figured I'd take you guys on my last little loop through Seven Link. So let's ride. And also stay tuned for uh, new wheelchair vlogs coming up because my chair was brand new when I did the first mini hospital tour. Okay, remember your numbers for your... Yeah. So, I'll give you guys the rundown of the rooms that I stayed at in this floor. Off to your right is the tub room. That's the tub room on your right. As you travel down this hallway, it's just down here. You get your playroom on your left. Nice and lit up today. And here is my, I'd say, most legendary room of all time. 764. So you know what? I'm going to take one little step in before we go. For old time's sake. Hard to believe I actually spent a month in this room. It's crazy, guys. Having your rib taken out and relocated to the front of your chest to fix your posture, and then putting the rods in two weeks later, it's really something. And that's why I was in that room for a month. We come down the end here. This room is not vacant. We have room 767, and that's where I stayed for my uh, rod installation when they extended the rods down to my back, or down to my hips, sorry. And in here is your nutrition room, if you want to cook a meal instead of ordering from their 24 seven um, food service. And now that it's daytime, 
we'll give you a good view from the family room here. So there's a good old view. I used to come down here almost every day when I was staying here, uh, when I was staying in room 764. So, we're gonna have to take a slight detour uh, this time because there was a room that there was a room that I forgot. Mm -hmm. Right here. Yep. Right here, room 768 is where I stayed for my left wrist surgery, which is technically the final surgery that I had on this floor. So we'll just zip along here. Point the camera down for a second. All right, let's move the ceiling. <laughs> so, yeah, I forgot that room last time. And as you come down here, the, the hallway splits up ahead, and it will lead us to the final room to show you guys that I stayed at. Door shut because it's obviously being used, but room 776. That was where I had my right hand redone. And let's just go this way to get a quick look at the nurse's station. It's a little sitting area off to your left. But yeah, here's the nurse's station. So I hope you guys enjoyed this final um, tour of the seven link uh, surgery recovery floor. I really appreciate you guys sticking around and all the support that uh, you guys gave me during the surgery journeys over the year or over the years. It's really helpful. So that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching.